Hey, what's up guys? This is Tyson here at IW Hockey. And right now we're taking a quick look at the Bauer Vapor RX5 roller hockey skate. It's a nice looking skate. It's really reaching that advanced level of performance in the Bauer Vapor line. Um, so starting us out on the bottom of the skate, this skate's going to be using the Lebeda Dynasty wheel. So great high grade wheel from Lebeda. This is going to be ideal for those indoor sport court type um, surfaces. Um, going on to the bearings, this is going to be the most affordable skate in the Bauer line that's using the Mission Swiss LE bearings. Um, so the Swiss ring is actually going to be one above the ABEC 9 scale. Um, so this is going to have a nice, very smooth roll to it. Um, going on to the overall holder on it, um, this is going to be the high-low frame. So you're going to have 76 millimeters in the front and um, 80 millimeter in the back. This is a 6,000 grade aluminum. So it's going to have a light feel, but also offer some great strength to the skate. Going on to the outsole, this is going to be the most affordable skate in the Bauer Vapor line that's using a fiber composite outsole, so that's going to offer a more rigid feel as well as being very lightweight. So it's going to make the skate more responsive, making sure that the, any of the foot movement is go, transferred right down to the bottom of the skate. Going on um, to the quarter package or the boot of the skate, you see a great jump in support and performance from the four to the five here um, in this material. Um, basically, this is going to be what they're calling an ultralight tech mesh. Um, this is uh, kind of has a fiberglass like feel to it, so it's going for a better durability. And as I mentioned, it has a lot more support to the skate, so it's going to make it more responsive and should last a little bit longer. Going on to the back side, you can see those. Um, that same rib design, so it's still going to have the same overall design as the rest of the Vapor series, so it's going to offer great stability, and as I mentioned, it has um, a great responsive feel as well. Going back to the front of the skate, um, this tongue that they're using on this is um, a little bit more of a beefier, a thicker tongue than what you saw on the 4. So basically you're going to have a lot thicker foams in that lace bite area to give you a little more protection um, against lace bite as well as maybe a stray shot or a slash. And this is a fairly traditional tongue still, so it's going to be a white felt. Um, you can see there it's stitched right down the center, so it's going to wrap around the ankle, give you a nice comfortable traditional feel. Going on to the liner in there, that's going to be a hydrophobic grip um, liner, so it's going to offer moisture wicking properties, keeping your foot a little bit drier, offering a little better fit during the game. And then also as we go ahead and pull out the footbed on this guy, um, it's the form fit footbed, so it offers a little bit of a cradle in the heel area to give you a little more support, but it has a very thin um, foam design, so you're going to have a great feel for the skate underneath your foot. So that's been just a quick look at the Bauer Vapor RX5 roller hockey skate available here at InlineWarehouse.com.